Welcome to State of Tech. Here's an iPhone 6 Plus tip for you. I'm going to show you how multitasking works. Now, whenever you open an application, so for example, I'll open up music. I'm using the music app. Let's just say I'm going throughout my normal day. I'm listening to some music during a workout. And then I hit my home button to come back home. Now, that doesn't really close the application. That just kind of puts it into the background. The way that you close an app is you double tap on the home button. So you actually press it in physically twice. And here we have the multitasking system. So I can swipe through and these are all of the applications that I've had open that are running in the background. Now, not all necessarily continue running, but there are some that will actually keep the services going. For example, the music app. If I was listening to music and I come out of the application, the music is still going to be running in the background using up my battery life for example, or if I'm streaming with Apple Music, it's going to continue using my cellular data or connecting over Wi-Fi. But some apps kind of go into a suspended state. So for example, the App Store, if I tap on the App Store, it brings me back into the App Store where I was last and then begins refreshing the app. Now you can have some of these apps automatically refresh in the background in the settings. So if we were to come into our settings and then go into the general tab, and then we'll go into the background app refresh. These are all the apps that are on my device and I can actually limit them to updating content in the background. So even if I don't close the app and I just have it lit running in the background, it can refresh its status and I can enable or disable these by sliding them on or off right here in the screen. And then if I really truly wanted to make sure an application was closed, double tap on the home button and it brings us back into multitasking. And what I do now is just swipe up on the app and it's going to close it. Now you can do one app at a time or what I like to do is I can swipe to where I can see three apps and I can use three fingers to close two multiple apps at the same time. So that is how you do multitasking on the iPhone. And for more tips and tricks, be sure and visit stateoftech.net.